Soaring above this mountainous skyline, the Golden Eagles of Riggindale at Horswater have long been a spectacular sight. But now it's feared this great predator is no more. Its guardians, those who've watched over it for years, haven't seen it since November. Just when it should be sky dancing in search of a mate, it's gone. Well, it's a very sad day for a lot of people. Um, the RSPB has been looking after these eagles and protecting these eagles since they first nested in 1969. And for this valley now to be empty, um, it's a very sad day for us and a very sad day for all those people. That sadness is shared by those who come to enjoy these lonely valleys. I've been coming here since I was a child and that's one of the things that we've always um, loved about this, knowing, and we've never seen it, but knowing that they were there. It's very sad to think that they um, are no longer there. We've lost you know, the eagle, the last one. And you need to go to Scotland now to be able to go and see one, which is very sad. But some are also angry that this iconic animal has lost its last English foothold, saying too much natural habitat has disappeared. In a world where we're trying to tell people about conservation and sustainable use of the environment, that we can't, in England, hang on to something as wonderful as a golden eagle, that's a disgrace. When the eagles first reappeared in this area in 1969, they'd been absent for something like 200 years. The RSPB thinks it won't take anything like as long this time to re-establish the birds, but it's clear that generations of people will be deprived of the chance to see one of the great predators of the Lakeland skies. It should be here. We should be seeing these birds thriving in these type of environments. And to see the bird, to be up in this landscape and to see the, to look up at the skyline and see the bird breaking the skyline, a huge bird, it, it's just spectacular and, and it feels very empty without it.